I have massive respect for Dice LA, so when I heard that Dice LA would be working on their own secret mode within Battlefield 2042, I did get very excited. And it's going to be a love letter to Battlefield fans, and we're going to see the announcement of this redacted mode, this secret mode, at EA Play on July 22nd. And the DICE developers right now are really hyping up this mode that is being developed by DICE LA. They're saying that it's going to be something very exciting, something incredible, a great addition to Battlefield 2042. So many more teams, including DICE LA, who've got some really exciting stuff to show us at EA Play, Oscar. Yeah, I mean, we first mentioned now we have folks in Stockholm, in, you know, Gothenburg and Guildford in LA, and, you know, folks across all over the world, actually, across Electronic Arts, you know, helping building Battlefield 2042. The stuff that's actually getting built out of DICE LA is quite special. Uh, the team joined our big team meeting. I think we broke some kind of Zoom world record. Lots of folks were actually in that meeting. Uh, and they got the chance to show the latest update from that experience. I think our chat kind of exploded. Yeah. Uh, the team's super pumped, and we're just looking forward to July 22nd at EA Play Live when we get the chance to show the world what the Dice LA team have been working on. It's quite special, I'd say. It's going to be good. And the rumours that are going around right now on Twitter is that this could be the remastering of classical maps, weapons and vehicles within Battlefield 2042. So we could potentially see the remastering of Battlefield 1942 maps. Maybe it could even be Battlefield Vietnam maps and say the Bad Company series, Battlefield 3. I think there would be so much scope to this and I think it really would be a very interesting mode to see within Battlefield 2042. And I know a lot of people, or at least some people, were quite disappointed about the fact that there was no campaign and the fact that it was only going to launch with seven multiplayer maps. So I think if we did have something like a Battlefield hub, which would be the remastering of classical maps, I really think that would increase the value of the whole package of BF2042 and would just make the multiplayer experience much, much better. And something that I did notice within the actual sort of uh, Twitch discussion that they did, they recently did a live stream where they were sort of rewinding, I guess, looking back at what they talked about, the reveal trailers, um, obviously the gameplay trailer as well. And I did notice that they did say in this live stream that we were launching with seven maps for our all-out war package. So that could hint at the fact that we will see more maps within other modes within Battlefield 2042. And I think this would fit in with the idea that DICE LA are working on this Battlefield hub, the remastering of older Battlefield games. And something that I want to show you on screen right now is a tweet that the senior design director at DICE LA tweeted way back in February of this year. He said, it's wondrous I get to work on a game I fell in love with almost 20 years ago. The sandbox play of 1942 was just amazing for its time. I look forward to hearing from all of you what you loved and hoped for in the future Battlefield game. So I guess in retrospect we can see here from everything that we've learnt that Dice LA are working on BF2042 on their own secret mode, it does kind of make sense that he's sort of reminiscing on the older Battlefield games, looking back at his great times on Battlefield 1942 and sort of the, the 20 years, I guess, with Battlefield games. So to me, it does kind of link in with the idea of remastering these older Battlefield games. And something to mention as well on the senior design director's sort of Twitter bio, it does say, bring in something crazy to the Battlefield franchise. And DICE are really hyping up this mode that they're working on. They're really sort of talking about how crazy this is going to be and how exciting this mode is going to be and how Battlefield fans are really going to love it. And if this is the case that we're going to see these remastering of maps and um, in higher fidelity and it'd be great to see destructible environments on some of the older games that where, where destruction wasn't present, that would be really great to see. So I think... This, that would be a crazy mode to see within Battlefield 2042. And again, the same senior design director was talking about how in, in this tweet here that you can see on screen right now. So now we've seen some gameplay clips of Battlefield 2042. How are we feeling so far knowing there's more to come? So again, they're really excited, I think, about this July 22nd EA Play reveal, which is when we're actually going to see this crazy mode that DICE LA have been working on.
So let me know your thoughts about this in the comments down below. I'm certainly very excited about the future of Battlefield 2042 and I think this would be the icing on the cake from Dice LA. So I'm very excited but let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Drop us a like and subscribe because I will be streaming the July 22nd EA Play event and I'll be giving you my live reactions and we'll be discussing it um, as always on that YouTube live stream. So until next time, have a good one.